He's been gaming for over 30 years, representing the common man in gaming, bringing you the new, the old, and everything in between. Here is your host, LMG. Hello everyone, and welcome to Alarm Dark Gameplay number 74. Oh, big day today, one day out before uh, the big sandbox update. And if you hadn't uh, already heard, with the new sandbox region, they are going to be interconnecting. And I will be bringing you that on Twitch and on YouTube uh, October 29th there on Wednesday. As soon as it comes out, I will be hard at work for you guys. All right. Yeah, we, after, between the, these gameplay episodes, 73 and 74 here, I am going to upload uh, the five hours we were streaming on Twitch. But we are at a re quick recap. We're at 161 days, about 162. Going fairly well. We did make our clothing decision, final clothing decision, because uh, we are running out of clothes rather quickly. I do want to give another quick shout out to uh, Stacy Plays. This is something I'm quite humbled by. She was kind enough to actually mention me in a few videos. Another fan was asked if everyone to reach out and do a, a collab. I'm going to see and try, but yeah, Stacy Plays is insanely popular. And she does some really great work. And I am just a small fish in a very big pond. But we will see. Yeah, I feel like I should at least owe her because she was kind enough to even mention me. But yeah, we'll get the last of our clothes on here. This is... One thing I didn't mention, we did talk about the work boots. Is work boots are kind of lame. They do have a nice uh, bonus there. But it requires cloth and leather to put in to, to repair it. But it also, uh, when you solve it, when you harvest it, you only get uh, leather back, which is kind of bogus, I think. Well, let's see if they continue the way they're doing that. Right, we're going to have to go up and get uh, some food here. It's about noon. I am preparing. It's just all the wood here. I am preparing for the Infinite fire near the end when we run out of clothes. We're going to, need to keep a fire going To slow down the condition decay, but uh, enough talk we should really we don't need to heal up quite yet But we should go out and get our food anyway Yeah, we're still pretty stocked on food and that's a lot of stuff. I haven't even picked up yet Yeah, I thought that was really kind of cool that uh, Stacy's place was even kind enough to mention me that was really awesome Still got two deer, because eventually what my uh, theory is, we're gonna be uh, gonna be naked. We're gonna be trying our hunting out here. So I'm not gonna be able to go very, very far without that condition just starting to skyrocket down. So I'm gonna be uh, fairly careful. I suppose there was a closer storage container. There usually sometimes is a backpack right behind the bunker there. Uh, not the bunker, the trapper's homestead. My apologies. Yeah, I'm trying the Chopper's Homestead. Remember that out. Uh, well, we could even use uh, Max here as the last resort. But Max is a, he's a frozen corpse, but he's uh, stationary, so the same properties don't seem to apply. We've done the math on that. It's, it, he's just like a regular corpse, so that's not actually a great idea. But if it comes down to that, we're going to prepare for the end time. And this will be a long recording run because I'm going to be recording all day. So I'll try to hammer this whole entire thing out. Because the save game files more than likely are not going to carry over. Pretty sure with the changes in the gameplay mechanics, not going to carry over. I've had a lot of experience in that. It's not When they, when they add something to the map, even a new sandbox region, it wouldn't uh, change the gameplay saves. But when they change up the mechanics, it usually does bugger the heck out of the save game. Alright. I'm going to check how much, because I might actually head out to the derailment and bring some more of that meat back. I've got a lot of wolf meat uh, up at the derailment. We could actually cram some of that in. 
So we've got one venison, and I'll check what we have up here. So we cram a couple in that one. I don't know, that one might be full also, though. So we might just head up and get our meal from the... Uh, derailment. Yeah, that'd be a good idea. So what's mentioning, yeah, I think the tunnel collapse, we'll go over here and look for a second. Yeah, that's pretty... Extra check the temp, negative 16, so we shouldn't, uh... Lollygagger on here too much, but as you can see, the tunnel collapse, the tunnel up here is, uh, pretty much... Intact, it looks like intact, nothing really bad happening. The thing is that they kind of just put these stationary, uh, rocks here. I mean, just, uh, pretty generic art assets. So I think they just mean for that to happen is they're going to take those out. And you'll be able to get into there. Or maybe through the hydro dam, because it does make a lot of sense why, uh, the railroad just stops for no reason. So I'm thinking it's going to be within two main entryways. And Bill Tarling, actually, on our uh, Twitch stream yesterday, he did mention, a, like, a little tease, because we were guessing about how he could get in there. And, uh, one of my viewers had actually mentioned, uh, Sorry, I'm just looking here real quick. Yeah, we're going to have to head back to... Let's head back to the derailment. I'm going to have to stop and warm up. Yeah, I'm going to stop and warm up for like an hour. Yeah, I mentioned that uh, if there's going to be a new bunker on the new sandbox map, because we were talking about that, if there's going to be a bunker. I think there should only really be the bunker in this map. It kind of... Uh, but maybe there would be a different kind of random location in the other map. Not necessarily a bunker, but something else. I'm going to give the bunker a special feel, as it were. But yeah, one of my viewers was talking about having a bunker, having a bunker on both maps and connecting, and Bill said he, that was kind of a close connection, so I don't know. That would be kind of neat, but oh, I don't know if I really like that idea. But yeah, I will be bringing you all the end-up coverage, and one thing we've definitely got to check out is we're going to check out the dam. Because I want to see if that mystery door is in there. I brought you that to you guys in Gameplay 30, but then they took it out, and I'm hoping it's going to make its way back in. Oh, there's going to be so much to cover. So I'll, I'll go through my first impression of the new map. I'll do a video on that. And then I'm going to do a patch notes video. Because you know I, I do love patch notes. That's my favorite thing to do really. I know it's sick but. Yeah then, we'll do, then I'm going to hop on Twitch. And we're just going to play play. I'm going to map out the new map. Got my pen and paper here. So we're just going to sketch out the new map. Get that work. Then somebody will come along and draw a very nice, much nicer one, and then I can just use that. <laughs> uh, and my art skills are lacking. But let's get in here for a little bit. Just to warm up. Yeah, well, pretty much I've left. I use this as a waypoint, but I really don't come here that much too often anymore. Yeah, we just got a couple minor things in here. I do miss my buddy Carl, but that uh, Trapper's Homestead bed is so op right now. Since we're really not having to hunt. Pretty easy. Just checking. Okay, so let's rest like, oh, maybe an hour. Cause it's getting about two, about two, so... We did forge uh, for t plenty of tinder plugs in the last bit of that live stream, so we should be we're, we're, we're really set on fire for quite a bit. Yeah, we got that cold mostly next. We're just gonna head out to the drill mint and back. Uh, I don't know if I should pick up all that wolf meat or not. And we uh, got all the tools extra out, uh, out on a Carl. All the way at the end of the south lake there by the second set of cabins. That's where all the tools are I'm keeping right now. Except for the rifle and the... The good rifle and the hunting knife. I've actually got those back at the other corpse just in case I need it. Can use those corpses as a waypoint as it were. That cold is... Negative three, that's actually not too bad. Yeah, we'll sprint this up a bit. Probably won't be able to get all the meat back, but I'm going to get some of it. Let's make that list a little bit easier. Nice thing about uh, the, getting the wolf meat is that each one is a 
1250 calories. So you only really need uh, two wolf uh, wolf meats to equal out your healing process with the Trapper's Homestead, which is really nice. Get a lot of bang for your buck. There was a wolf up here last time, so we got to be a little more uh, cautious. And later, I think if we're still up here, he ran from us last time. We're going to try to lure him into a deer if we can find one close range. Yeah, he's been hanging out up there for the most part. I don't see him today. Um, we're actually going to try to keep... Uh, we'll take back four. I'm going to use two. Let's just see if we can uh, cram a couple extra in there. So at least we don't have to come back for a while. We've got plenty of canned goods up in that uh, backpack in there also. So we've got uh, we've got quite a bit. You eat trees? Yeah, food is not my problem. Cloth is the problem. But we've done the best we can, so... I'm hoping to get at least a 200 uh, day run out of this. But I'm going to keep plugging away on this all day. And then hopefully after that runs over I can start doing the bunker video. Worst thing about uh, the October 29th update is I just don't know when it's going to happen. Ah! Drive me crazy. Essentially, you know, I'd love to do a marathon on Twitch, but I just don't know when the update is. Yeah, because I did have a lot of fun in that 24-hour uh, marathon. So I'm probably planning a marathon in the future. If not, uh, not on Wednesday, eventually soon. We'll try another 24-hour marathon there. Ugh. Come on, Will. You can do this. Well, another thing I was going to talk about, I know a lot of people have been, I mean, I know uh, Meta Boy, he actually had a, this is a pretty funny death, actually. He actually, I, I he survived quite a number of days, I think that he's, uh, I want to say he's number three or four on the leaderboard right now. He actually did some study of some of my work initially, and then he's just taken it to a whole new new level. But yeah, I guess he uh, stripped naked and jumped off the, off the bridge. <laughs> Well, yeah, I've kind of fell off, you know, just, uh, I'm like, that's pretty funny. But no, I guess, sure, I'm not going to die anyway, stupid. I try to, I'm going to just push as hard as I can on this one. The only time I died stupidly was that, uh, got in gameplay number 68 when I, uh, just got lost in the dark. That was just plain silly. Let's see what we can cram in here. Well, let's actually try to see if we can get into the other corpse here. Which I'm pretty much gonna guess that this is gonna these corpses are gonna get nerfed along with reclaimed wood. Well, let's see. I think there's what they're gonna do is probably put a limit on the, the amount of reclaimed wood you can get out of a house or indoors. Because otherwise, that just because I got a fire skull of a hundred right now, so that uh reclaimed wood is just like nothing to me now. But let's let's get get that in there. I'm getting pretty fatigued. I'm not. What am I carrying? It might just be my imagination. Uh, I seem to get more fatigued as the days go on. It's probably my imagination, actually. Let's keep on keeping on. I do a little more hibernating than usual because we're going to run up. I'm going to go uh, pro style and we're going to try to extend our time as much as possible. It's not like we have 
Because at least until I get negative 1,500 calories, because I'm like, we're going to have, a, we have a lot to do anyway. There's no more exploring to be done. There is a little bit of food we can still pick up that I haven't picked up, but we, our food supplies are so crazy good right now at 160 days that I'm not going to really mess with that too much. I think we're down to seven bullets also. Which is a fun little fact in this run. I think I believe the most I got was 20 bullets out of this run. And I and I actually only think I made half the shots. <laughs> I, I I missed so many deer uh, that Monday before, yeah, a week ago on Twitch. I just, I couldn't hit the broadside of a barn, folks. I don't know what was going on, but. Yeah, the only thing safe was the deer. Oh, that's embarrassing. Let's get back home. I'm going to try to wait to heal up for a little bit also. Makes me wonder, did I put my clothes I did put my clothes on, but I still have this. Uh, really cool day. All these cargo pants on. And the, the quality winter coat's just starting to suffer enough that's going to be not be quite enough to just wear inside. Yeah, we're gonna two degrees, so that should be plenty fine though. I'm hydrate. Oh, I'm gonna pick up some more water. Okay. I'm probably gonna wait around maybe. 13, 14%, we'll have to see. Okay, let's get... I'm going to go to Forge for about four hours, because we're getting kind of fatigued anyway. Not that I need wood, but I just want to kind of uh, prepare. And I really want to cover this entire floor with wood for some reason. I don't know why I want to do it, but... It's something that needs to be done. I need to do that. Okay. Just want to be sure to make sure we got hydrated. Okay, I'm going to do. I'm going to find 13%. I think I'd be fine with. Alright, we're at 162 days. So it's nice. Very nice. So best probably just to heal up now. It's a good idea. We got two wolf meat. That yeah, should bring us right around about a thousand. Yep. Oh man, my math is crazy good. It'll make us a little bit thirsty, which I would imagine you'd be thirsty after consuming the flesh of a wolf. Still with no seasoning or anything? Oh. Man, Will. You're gonna be hurting. So we're gonna rest another 11 hours. Yeah, I'd never suggest going over 11 hours. It's... Very dangerous at that point. And granted, anything... A lot of this is likely to change on Wednesday. Well, I'm probably going to go back to more of the old school mechanics, which I really loved. They made this game a little too easy. Even though it's funny, like, the only majority, like, one point, I was checking out the stats on the Steam the other day, that only, like, 0.5 or 0.08 or something like that have made the, actually the 50-day achievement. 
Only like 1.5% of the people have made the 30 day achievement. Uh, I just, I, I, granted, I have played this game a little bit more than other people, but it seems crazy to me. Okay, we still have about 10 calories. So we're going to ride that out. You burn a lot less calories sleeping than you would doing other activities, so. Yeah, we're still only at negative. So we could actually go. It's going to sleep the day away. Then we'll be at negative 1500 and then we can go about our business because it won't really matter then. All right, 77%. All right. Make sure we hydrate. Get some more water than that. I was thinking if I want to get some more water going, I might get some more water going today. See how many matches. I was only carrying a few matches because I'm still storing those. Because once those go south, it's going to kind of suck. I do have plenty of matches, though. Just uh, 17 to plug, so we're still good for quite a while. Actually, yeah, let's get... You know, I hate to use any of this wood, but I can't show off my good uh, fire skill there. I'll grab you because you're just completely out of place there. That's about five. Ah, uh, but we got really nothing to do, so that's okay. Yeah, hundred percent uh, chance. Yeah, that is nice. So I'm pretty sure it's impossible for me to screw up a fire now. Which is pretty nice. Ah, there we go. Need about a four hour fire and let's get five liters going. Gonna melt another, or boil five liters. My apologies. Okay. Done. Hydrate a little bit of that. We're just going to keep going until we get tired here. A little bit more. Another five liters. Like a boss. All right. Oh, another thing I meant, I'll have to mention this at the top of the next uh, episode. But I want to, yeah, Granny Gamer, uh, Granny Gamer, uh, a sub and a fan. She actually made it into number eight on the leaderboard. So. I did mention earlier that uh, everybody who usually studies my work and fans of my work, are a lot of them are in the top 10, top 20. Yeah, top 10, 20 there. That is very humbling, really. Maybe it did bring a little bit of a tear to my eye, gotta admit. That's really awesome helping people, I just enjoy that. So let's actually get 5 liters here. Here we go. Some more. Another five. 
Okay, there we go. Drop another five. Oh, I dropped. There's probably a bottle with only point zero one in it, but oh uh, well. It's an hour, two hours, three. And I could just fill up the stove for like eleven hours and just keep going, but I don't want to waste wood. If I decide to stop. Hydrate while we're at it. So we got all this free water. Never asking where the water bottles are coming from. Okay. I get at least one more run in. Another five liters boiled. Okay. So I'm gonna drop. Let's just drop about only about two of that. And yeah, two point five. Still something to carry around and yeah. getting pretty fatigued though, so I should probably call it a morning? Oh, that's already right. I know crazy water party. It's nine in the morning here. All right, that's looking a little better. So we'll let the fire die out. Hydrate, and we'll get some Z's here. Hundred sixty five days. Okay. okay yes, yeah, so I've made my prediction that eventually the cloth will lead to me getting killed, but you never know. Something could go horribly wrong. Oh, why do I say that? Okay. Mm hmm. About 49%, so. I might as well keep working on the wood supplies. That's a safe bet. At this point, if you're foraging outside, it's uh, just plain silly because it'll deteriorate the cloth faster. I really only need uh, reclaimed wood. I only go outside if I need to forge for uh, tinder plugs. If we space that out, we should be fine on tinder plugs. Drop. Okay. Let's actually hydrate. I was supposed to run out on a pretty strict uh, schedule. Sleeping at night, you know, getting myself on a schedule. But now I've kind of just lost all track of time. <laughs> As Will McKenzie's madness has set in. But let's actually go for another six hours. Yep, we got seven. Not bad. Let's keep piling it on here. I'm 
probably, I don't know if I want to stretch it out here though. I kind of like my water right here. Probably stretch it out all the way to the door. That would be kind of funny. Right, let's check. I don't know, we could probably get a couple more hours in of forging here. Right, let's forge about two hours. pieces that's okay okay I probably actually want to go get my uh, meal this afternoon if we're gonna This could be a rest, and it's going to be nighttime, then we're going to have to rest again, and I'll be down to around 11% or so, and ah, that's a little... Just be safe in case anything goes wrong. 165 days. Oh, that's nice to see. And just a quick reminder, since I know a couple people are asking me, uh... Yeah, it doesn't update on the leaderboards until... I die. I do have a piece of cloth left, but I'm trying to save it so one of the other pieces goes out. Probably the mittens are going to go out next. And then I will actually just put that right into the winter coat again. That's going to warm me up the most, keep me alive as long as I can. Give a cup of water for the road just in case. And we're going to go ahead and get that wolf meat. And we decided uh, during the live stream that the jerry can is not useless. It is out here. This is my uh, pecan. This is where we, this is where we do our business. Cause we're not savages. Uh, oh, sorry. I just thought that was really amusing at the time. Let me make sure I'm wearing clothes. Oh, I almost forgot to take off without without the clothes on. I'm known for doing that on occasion. Huh? Let's head out. Oh, nice day today. And don't worry too much because uh, from uh, I've been on this map such a long time now that really only the wolves and by the railman in the clear cut area is the only place I've seen wolves. Like this whole area looks like the wolves have abandoned for some reason. I think pretty much for most of the time I've been on the map there's been no wolves out here. Which is all random. It's random every time but this is usually the, the pattern that I always seem to get. Oh, don't run. Oh. And, dear viewers, at this point, I think I should have really just, uh, had a path worn between here and if anybody's counted how many times I've gone up and down this way it's just crazy at this point there actually is a quicker way but if you go straight off from the deadfall area I think but I always get lost somehow Soon we'll have to go on another hunting expedition while the clothes are still. Cause I'd really like to more have nail a wolf. It's a little less meat, but the with the calories increase from that, it's a little bit more of a payoff. It's a little easier to manage. Wolf deer kill would be nice, but it comes down to a place of storing all that meat. I'm running out of room. As the further out I have to store things, it's just man, more work and more work. Okay, let's get 
Uh, Carl over here. Oh, Carl would be so pissed if he knew I was naming other corpses Carl. Oh man, we'd be in trouble when we got back. Uh -huh. But the 73% of the ah, it's still, I still would have had the wolf meat because it's just less I have to, because I'm going to have to chase that with some canned goods. So let's just not mess with that. Next trip, we'll go out and grab the rest of that wolf meat. Maybe go on a hunting trip. Yeah, I don't know. Because my permanent goal right now is to hit 200 days. Let's see if I can do better than that. If I had better cloth management and some better rules in the beginning, I think it would go longer than that, but... Uh, we'll see how long I can go naked, though. It will be fun to see how fast that cold goes up. Yeah, we definitely won't be going out in the early morning naked. That... Oh. I'd be insta death. And I'm walking because I don't want to fatigue it too much because I want to. Actually, I think we could actually because we're in. A, we're 28 percent. Sure, no real harm. Top of the hill. Top of the hill. Oh, that is beautiful. And as I pointed out before, yeah, if you're ever looking for corpses, and we'll be doing this on the new map, because I'm sh pretty sure the, the same mechanics will apply. Now, if you're looking for a frozen corpse or a corpse in general, these birds are generally, most of the time, always circling over. So you'll be able to, be able to tear f hear from the sound and just follow the visual cue, and you'll be able to find a corpse really easy. I mean, if you're into that sort of thing, I mean... And looking for corpses. Keep your minds out of the gutter, people. Yeah, so the next heal up, maybe we plan out a little hunting expedition again. I'd really like to find a wolf deer kill, but uh, it's just been pretty sparse picking wolf-wise, but we'll see what we can do. The problem with that last wolf is that he uh, fled when he saw me, so they do do that occasionally, not as bad as they were doing before, because I had a real problem <clears throat> earlier when they nerfed wolves. They actually, they were just all running from me. Kind of funny. And they would actually run from deer. That was, the, that was the best part. So you literally could not get a wolf to get, <laughs> kill a deer. It was hilarious. Deers with a new alpha predator. Right, let's get. And we'll stash the meat real quick. Okay. We don't need it quite yet. So how we doing? I'm going to have to forge for some more wood here. About six hours. Yep, 21%. So we're trying to go further, closer to the door. And we're getting there. Pretty fatigued. So actually this will work out rather nicely. We'll come out maybe about 10% or so. Then we'll heal up. We'll go on another hunting expedition, I think that would be good. Okay, so make sorry, double check to make sure I always want to make sure my thirst is okay. About nine in the morning. There we go. Been about ten percent or so. Oh, 
Oh no. My heartbeat. Oh. Okay, let's grab our food. And heal up. So I need to be able to make sure I grab another water. Sure, all the other stats are okay. Wait, actually, okay, yeah, just that might have been bad. Make sure we're hydrated all the way down. Okay, there we go. And bam. Oh, and 100%. Okay, 167 days. All right, all right. It's about nine o'clock at night. So we're gonna rest up since we got excess calories still anyway. Okay, it's gonna go down. I probably won't actually wait to the whole 1500 negative. Let's we'll see how the time plays out. We're not getting going this early because it's just way too cold. I'll probably just rest because I want to wear down those extra calories and it's not quite time to leave yet. About noon would be a good time. Let's always start warming up about then. We're going to have a lot of ground to cover if we do... Go on a hunting expedition here. Alright. Grab our clothes. Eh, pretty easy to grab our clothes now. We don't we don't have any. I think it's 84% worth. I'm fairly confident on my sort of skills here on the map, so. Percentage wise, I'd even hunt around 30 or 40% right now. Okay. Let me make sure I check how much. Apologies, viewers. Just want to make sure I have. Now we can grab some water up. I should have at least a little bit of water up at the camp on camping office. Must be going a little mental because I thought I heard a wolf for a second, but nah. Uh. So I'm running until I get up to the corpses, and then I'm gonna probably I'll pick up my hunting knife and the rifle, and then we're gonna not run because that's gonna be a little bit too much weight to run full out all the time. One's picking up with the temper. Ah, negative 18. Ooh, still a biting one today. Let's also do the fact that the clothes are starting to suck more and more. But it looks like it is pretty windy. Yeah. 
Yeah, oof. I think it's nerves I did kind of do miss was the... I don't think it's actually in this one. Yeah, nope. I do miss these to show uh, what direction the wind was going in and all that, too. In the pre-alpha days, but... It's a nice little option, but it's not the thing you really needed, but... Of course, I used to be able to tell what the weather was like and the wind was going when you're inside. And that was kind of nice. Especially in the area if you didn't know how the weather was inside, because you can't hear it inside the dam. In a couple other places, you can't hear the wind. Alright. Okay. And the other rifle is actually still at the. Uh, on the south lake with the rest of the tools. Let's actually shift that out a bit. Actually, I'm getting a little colder, so let's just run. We can rest for about an hour. We'll grab that water. If there's any left over there, and we'll get on our way. And we do need a little bit more water while we're up at the... Let's check how many... Real quick, sorry, I gotta check make sure I have enough matches if we are hunting. Uh, three, that'd be one I imagine I would need. At most, I'll grab one kill. I don't want to get too greedy. That has been the end of many a player. Sometimes we just add yeah, that. That's what happened to me in that gameplay 68. Because I was out cooking too late. I kept getting all that. I had more meat than any man I would ever need. It would have gone bad before I could have actually eaten it all. I was having such good luck. I just didn't want to stop. And that's was the problem. And that would have been a great run too. But and that's just what it might have been. We just do the best we can. Go, go, go warm up a little bit, rest, get back on the way. This is always a nice waypoint, even if I am at hanging out at the trap or said now. Okay. It's always nice to see my buddy Carl. Hey Carl, I know I haven't been around in a while. I'm sorry, don't hang your head down, buddy. It's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. Back. Why can't I take your backpack? That's all I want to know. Yeah, we've got a little bit of water here, so. Let's cleanse our thirst. I might just take a lot of that with me just in case. If we're going to be up there for a little bit. Oh, not that much. About two hours. Let's hope the weather doesn't go south. I won't get any hunting in today. Most likely tomorrow. Let me check my weight. Oh, we should be fine. I'm actually going to take all this. I'll leave two. Make sure how much I have. Yeah, that should be fine for the trip. And I can always get more if I have to. Going. Sounds reasonably nice out. Oh, I light snow. Okay. And only negative five. Okay, yeah, we're we're good. We're still a little heavy to be running out crazy like that. So let's have a check. Yeah, with seven bullets. Yeah, I will run out of cloth before I run out of bullets. I'm pretty sure. Well, I know my shooting. Oh, who knows? I'm recording this all day, so I want to get to the end of this run. So we can start fresh. You know, a little, little tip that you could do is, uh, even though it's going to mess with the save game, you're going to probably more likely die. But as, if the right leaderboard wipes, I don't even know I'm telling you guys this, but probably a lot of you probably already figured that out. You can't just die 
on Wednesday, and if the leaderboard resets, you'd be on top. So that's just a little tip to you. I'm not going to do that, but I just feel like gaming the system a little bit. But you will see my death sometime on the leaderboard today. And hopefully I'll get all these videos out before uh, Wednesday, but I'm not entirely how long this run's going to go. So you might see a little bit more of the new map before I get all these out. I do apologize, but so it's my fault for never dying. Nice day, and actually, be a little bit more careful. This dang wolf is hanging out here again. He has managed to ambush me a time or two because I wasn't paying attention, but... He always comes out on that side, on that other side. And there used to be, actually, in pre-alpha, there used to be, like, a wolf here and, like, a wolf there. It's like, there was no easy way to ever get past here. A wolf here would actually be pretty nice. We could call that a day if we, if we had him out here, but... I don't think he wants to play today. The clear cut is usually a place where I can find wolves, so hopefully. I'll try to get a wolf deer kill. Yeah, no wolf sighting here today. Maybe he's taking a little nap. I believe that is just the scenery music. The wolf there. Yeah, certain spots you hit in the map or just uh, do that occasionally. If you hear a growl or the bark, that's usually the sign you're, you're in deep crap, so you should probably run. Not into the wolf, but... I'm going to check out here for a second, because we haven't been too much on this. We haven't gone down this way too much. I want to give a quick uh, looky loo to the the hunting pattern down here for all the wildlife. Be careful of that rock. That's where a wolf could just pop out of that. Eighty percent, I could survive a wolf attack. Pretty sure. It's just the area leading out to it'll, it'll pop under the bridge, but I just want to give a quick. Just in case there was a random item or something that spawned anyway, I was just thinking about that. There's a backpack with like a full set of clothes down here. Oh, I'd be so pissed. I don't see anything. Do got deer on our left. Got an ice real quick here. Yeah, nothing much to see. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hold that thought, guys. Hold that thought. Okay. So we don't want to spook anybody, but we could have a wolf deer kill in progress here. That deer would go a little slower. And he's not quite. Uh, I could. I'm gonna try to lead him into it, maybe. Cause I don't think they're on the same path. Yeah, let's try to get his attention and go back. Maybe. Worst case scenario, I get the wolf, but the wolf deer kill would be much more awesome. Waiting for it to happen naturally might not. Oh, where is the deer now? Getting him would be nice, but I'd like to get the deer too. Where do you run off to? Oh, you little... Oh, I guess. That'd be okay. 
I don't think he's quite noticed at this point, but let's try to go back up a little bit more and see if we can catch that deer's location. If I didn't spook him already. Dang it. Well. This is a pretty easy kill, so. As long as he doesn't run. Okay, he's not going to run. Oh, jeez. There we go. I don't want to lose than I thought. There's some easy vittles. Alright. Yeah, that deer was going way clip too fast for us to get them together, but this is okay. You get slightly less meat, but it's higher calorie content, so it actually is a little better. So we're down to six bolts now. Okay. And we had a blizzard. Awesome. That's great. I knew that was going to happen. Uh, so what we might want to do is head back. Make sure we're... Uh, we're not too fatigued, so let's actually just gun it. Even though we're not... I can camp is an okay area, but I really gotta get this meat cooked, so let's head back. Well, we should have enough... Uh, And my brain went dead there for a second. We should have enough uh, wood in there left, I think. That we should be able to cook this up. I could just store this in a frozen corpse and make a run for it, but... Uh, no pain, no gain, I think. And knowing my luck, I would get the blizzard. Well, using the railway as a guide, we're pretty safe, for the most part. I, mean, during the, I don't know if anybody else knows during, during the blizzard. It just seems to be... Ah, it seems blizzard takes... Even though faster you walk, it seems it should, we don't go nearly as far as we do usually do, but... Okay, we're up it. We'll be careful on the left here, just in case. Wolf sneaking up on me would really suck at this point. Especially since they know I killed their brother. Uh, the reason I did kill that wolf back there, uh, even though I couldn't get him into the wolf deer kill, which would have been gone south of the way longer because that would have just been in the middle of a blizzard then. Okay. It's really the hard part, uh, seeing where. Keep on the screen to the left enough so we can see with it. It uh, faces off into the left. Not quite yet. Yeah, we've still got a ways to go. Yeah, they get trying to get that wolf deer kill in the middle of the blizzard would have really sucked. So I think maybe here. That's pretty close, I think. Go a bit and see. If now we can just head tail it straight south again. Yeah, there we go. Nailed it. Oof. Yeah, that was getting cold quick, but... Okay. Let's grab all the wood we have on. I think I did leave a little bit of a stockpile here. Not much, though. I took most... I took, like, 59 reclaimed wood. That's as much as I could carry. And we're actually going to probably need all of this, actually. I'm not even sure I can get it all cooked since they 
split it up in a half kilogram pieces instead of the full kilogram. Takes quite a bit longer to cook. I think we should probably get that close to done. Right, so now we got the fire going. Seven hour fire might be a little accessible. We've got a lot of meat to cook, so I want to get that done. Let's we'll check out fatigue. I'm not really that fatigued, so we should be okay. Probably go out back to the drill mint and start storing this, store some more of this. I might just live on wolf meat now. Not a bad idea, not a bad idea really. Wolf deer kill would be nice, but yeah, wolf meat is uh, rather economical. <laughs> Plus they don't run most of the time. Yeah, see, so through degradations. Really sad, we didn't even go that far. It'd be nice to go out tonight and get it that in a... We did have that frozen corpse outside, that was really nice, but now we don't, so... It's gonna have to sit in the container at least tonight. Until we can get going again. I'm not going out there tonight, I tell you that. Oh, and we're done, actually. Let's not check how fatigued we are. A little bit, but... Let's just container that meat. So as we cook that, it actually contained like a kilogram less than... Yeah. Hydrate up, and we'll get a little bit of water going here, so we're gonna replace what we took, at least. Just in case we head back this way, then for the next time. Ooh, I hope that's enough. Time. Let's see. Ooh, gonna get close. Gonna get close. Yeah, all right. Cool. Hydrate up, I'm going to drop that. Of course, that's way too much to... Heh. Okay. Alright. Probably holster that ladder. We don't need that right now. Yeah, sleep for 11 hours. And we'll be about noon. That'll be. I should get the clothes back on, but that's alright. That's okay. Alright, 168 days. And I don't feel so good. Yeah, each of these is one whole meal, so we've got... Oh, quite a bit, quite a bit. It's only about a 92% overnight. That's in that cupboard. So we're okay. Check our water for the trip just in case. Oh, we're good, we're good. So a little bit here. I don't think I'm gonna... I should leave some... Next time we come back here, I'll bring some firewood, maybe, just so in case we need to cook up here again. It'll make a little more sense. I hate leaving it completely abandoned there. Okay. Then we'll store up the rifle again. Back in those frozen corpses back there.
I apologize. I do know we're running a bit long in this episode, but I'm just having such a good time. But we will stop once we get to Trapper's Homestead. Just let me just uh, <laughs> play a little more. Let me play a little more. I don't want to stop playing yet. Just got so wrapped up in the game. I'm in the zone right now. So I'm not really wanting to stop. Just right, careful. Okay, so I know he's probably still up here. That's my fear of just trying to go store stuff around that corpse and just getting waylaid. He's not gonna sneak up on us fast, I don't think, so Okay. Whoa, 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 No, 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 no. Okay, oh shoot. Run, run. Crawl up. Why did I say that? Why did I say that? Why did I say that? Oh my god. We gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. Oh! Yeah, see, he ninjas me up. We actually gotta get... Actually, no, keep running right now. We're not doing that quite yet. That little... Oh, that little... Dude... Vengeance. Vengeance. Oh, this is the blood trail. Oh, we're leaving a blood trail. Okay, actually, we gotta quickly take care of that. Oh. Oh, man. Alright. Okay, so new plan, new plan. This is the second attack we've had, uh, this run. Okay, we're healed up from that, but what we're gonna do... Uh, we'll keep the rifle and the hunting knife on us. And we'll destroy the meat for now. I don't know what time it is, about 1 o'clock. Ow! Oh! I hate doing that though. I should go back there and just kick his. Uh, next time, tomorrow. Well, next time I come out here, that that dude's dead. I've had enough of this crap. All right, let's just go store the meat and get back. And I could repair up the rifle and the knife while I'm at it anyway. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, that little b <laughs> that little guy almost had me there. Oh. Hey, yeah, I just totally didn't even see him. He just snuck around that corner there, and that's always a bad place for an ambush. Just teaches you a lesson, no matter how long you play, how good you get, you can still sneak up on you. Yeah, I started to run to get some distance so I could turn around, but then he was just there. Yeah, that's the problem with that frozen corpse out there. It's easy to get waylaid if you're not constantly circling around and double checking. I thought we were safe, but we weren't safe. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot of quick quick strikes, got him off, that's all you really need to do, I didn't try to kill him, I just need to get him, need to get him off of me so I could get away, okay, let's, gonna need, that is full once again, yeah, but he is my next meal, I guarantee you viewers, he is, he's dead, Nobody puts baby in a corner. Oh. We just still do have plenty of antiseptic and bandages up at the camping office, so we're still pretty set. And I do have even more back at the Trapper's Homestead in case that happens again. But I think we can. I want to just make sure there's no... I'll mess with that later. I'm going to try to get the rifle in there, but... 
We're just going to work on repairing it up anyway. Next episode. Dang that wolf. Ah! He waited like 170 days before he tried to get me again. Little bugger almost had me. Yeah, you better run, dear. I am not in the mood today. Not in the mood. You know, I could shoot you right now. I don't even want to shoot you. Run away. Run away. I do love how the Dear AI, never really get confused on their pathing also. Like, you think he'd go up there and try to do something and get caught? And no, he never does. He always runs off in that way. Yeah, see, he's... He's long gone. Ah, we're home. Close off. Oh, those mittens are starting to go. Okay, I'll check the stats real quick. A little more cold than anything. I guess I could get a little bit of forging done. I don't want to kill it quite yet. I'll calm my nerves a little after that. Wow, oh, wolf attack. Ah. Do you guys say we've still gotten, I've gotten pretty good at fending off wolves. Yeah, it's really never worth it in the long run to get a... Trying to build up the strength of that attack. Because while you're doing that, he's just mauling the crap out of you. bit fatigued here. Alright. Should we wait? Ah, we can heal it now. It's okay, we're gonna... In this episode, since we were running very long. I apologize. If it would have ended earlier, maybe we wouldn't have ran into that wolf. Uh, I don't know, it's debatable, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna hydrate to make sure that doesn't... I don't think the fatigue should affect the heal too much. Well, we've already ate, so now it's too late to think about that. It's about 5.30 in the morning. Alright, 100%. Nice. Uh, the fatigue didn't affect that too much, actually. Alright, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. It's really, been really a lot of fun bringing this run to you. Yeah, straight off the 24-hour marathon. Still going strong at 169 days. So, I'll be recording all day. I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to like and subscribe. So I continue to bring all long dark coverage and that new sandbox map for the tomorrow. Can't wait. Alright guys, I will see you in the next episode.